like most people don't know, but you can bypass China's Great Firewall without buying a VPN. If you have internet service in your home outside of China, you can set up a VPN server at home and connect back to your own VPN server while traveling to China. There are several benefits to hosting your own VPN server. 1. You don't have to pay a subscription fee. 2. You'll have better security because you don't have to reveal your identity or data to a third party. And 3. It'll actually work better. With an ordinary VPN service, many clients are connected to a single VPN server. The Great Firewall can easily identify the connection pattern and block the VPN. If you are hosting your own VPN server at home, you are probably the only client, making it harder for the Great Firewall to identify and block the connection. The only problem is, it takes a lot of effort and technical knowledge to set up a VPN server. The PCWRT router has made the process really simple. Next, I'll show you step by step how to set it up in about 5 minutes, and demonstrate the results of bypassing along the process. The PCWRT router provides other functions such as ad blocking, encrypted DNS, access control and network monitoring, etc. But we'll be focusing on VPN here. Step 1. Check public IP address. You need a public IP address to run a VPN server. If you know you have a public IP address, you can skip this step. Open your browser. Go to duckduckgo.com. Search for my IP. You will see your public IP address displayed in the results. Next, log on to the router. Check the one side IP address. If it is the same as the previous IP address, then you have a public IP address. Proceed to the next step. Step 2. Set up DDNS. Enable DDNS. Update the domain name. Step 3. Enable and start the VPN server. You can see the domain name is pre-populated here. Check LAN, guest and internet. Add a user. The VPN server is successfully started. Device Step 1. Install the VPN app. Search for WireGuard and install. Device Step 2. Import VPN configuration and start the connection. Here, I'm back to the router VPN page. Click the QR code icon to show the QR code. I have taken a screenshot of this page and sent it to my friend in China. This is my friend's phone. You can watch CCTV5 Sports Channel now because it's connected to Chinese internet service. Now I'm going to set up the VPN on this phone.
scan the QR code. Start the VPN connection. Go back to CCTV. The sports channel is no longer available. However, we can now watch YouTube. If you have more than one device, you can create additional users on the router. For example, Snow White can create VPN user accounts for each of the seven dwarfs. She can create an account for the prince too. Mark the prince as guest, which means when the prince connects to the VPN, he can only visit the internet but has no access to Snow White's internal network. 